China is starting to carry out its goal of developing sophisticated humanoid robots that are genuinely able to replace people. Beijing stated in September of this year that it has established a state fund with a $1.4 billion budget to promote advancements in robotic technologies. The goal of the project is to build humanoid robots with independent power sources that will eventually take the place of people in industrial settings to carry out particular activities. The fund will be used to create attractive commercial ventures, finance mergers and acquisitions of local enterprises, and incubate cutting-edge innovations, according to Beijing's Municipal Bureau of Economy and Information Technology. The fund will also be used by Beijing authorities to give subsidies in order to hasten the supply chain development for robotics components and equipment. The fund is part of China's broader efforts to transform Beijing into an international industrial robotics hub. By 2025, the country of China is expected to have 500 robots for every 10,000 workers. The China Electronics Institute reports that the size of the Chinese robotics market was $17.4 billion in 2022 and is predicted to grow to $25.1 billion by 2024. China also offers a great deal of possibilities for additional automation. Shanghai has announced intentions to establish a humanoid robot industry fund comparable to Beijing's, with a budget of $1.4 billion, according to Reuters Agency. The same strategy that made China the world leader in electric vehicle manufacturing is being used to drive the country into the burgeoning humanoid robot business. This strategy includes strong supply chain development, government backing, and intense pricing rivalry among numerous new competitors. The Chinese humanoid robot sector is demonstrating distinct advantages in terms of mass production capability and supply chain integration, and the nation is actively implementing its ambitions. For example, Zhili has begun to use humanoid robots in the production of automobiles. King Long, China's first full-size general-purpose humanoid robot, made its debut at Xinjiang High Tech Park in Shanghai early in July 2024. It is anticipated that the robot's open architecture would spur advancements in artificial intelligence and robotics. Sherry also unveiled Mornin, a humanoid robot created in association with a MOGA experts that is fashioned after a long-haired girl with spectacles. And this is just the start. Numerous Chinese enterprises have developed their own humanoid robots this year that are competitive with their counterparts from other countries. Presently, China holds half of the world market for industrial robots. China's production of industrial robots reached 430,000 units in 2023. Additionally, half of the world market for industrial robotic systems is controlled by China. China's robotics sector has advanced significantly in terms of invention and development. According to documents made public by the Ministry of Sector and Information Technology in late August 2024, by the end of 2023, there will be nearly 10 times as many robots per 10,000 workers in the nation's manufacturing sector as there were 10 years ago, 49 versus 470. Robotics adoption in the manufacturing sector is a high political priority for the Chinese government, which sees these machines as essential to raising productivity and boosting national and global competitiveness. China reportedly has 18% more robots installed per manufacturing worker than the US. The degree of robot usage in China's manufacturing business is 12 times higher than that of the U.S. market, despite the fact that wages in the country's manufacturing sector have historically been substantially lower than in the U.S. China is the world's greatest region in terms of industrial robot usage, according to the International Federation of Robotics. Over 290,000 of these units were deployed in 2022, which was 5% more than the previous record established in 2021. More over 190,000 robotics-related patents were pending in China as of July 2024, making up about two-thirds of all patents worldwide. Chinese robotics companies have been contributing to their growth in the global robotics market by using aggressive pricing techniques. It was announced at the beginning of March 2024 that China had started manufacturing robotic dogs that could shoot weapons like trained troops. Even military exercises use these four-legged machines, it has been observed that several nations are attempting to modify robotic canines for use in combat environments. For instance, Boston Dynamics created a quadruped robot for the U.S. military. But the technology was only ever tested because of excessive noise and other issues. In terms of technology, Chinese robotic dogs were initially less advanced than their American counterparts. But Chinese developers quickly caught up. Early in 2024, 
Chinese robotic dogs will be able to run continuously for over four hours while towing a 20-kilogram weight, climb stairs, and execute acrobatic maneuvers like backflips. Chinese engineers outfitted a robotic dog with a machine gun chambered in 7.62 millimeters. The robot fired 10 shot bursts at a human-sized target that was 100 meters away during testing. The robot showed excellent shooting accuracy. If it had been directed at a person's chest, the majority of the bullets would have struck the region around the heart. The maximum gap between the target's center and the five nearest bullet holes was only five centimeters. Chinese tech companies debuted humanoid robots in mid-August 2023 that are almost identical to humans. These devices are capable of complex activities, precise hand movements, replication, and facial expression mimicking. Specifically, EX robots displayed motorized arms in addition to animatronic heads with artificial skin. These devices are ideal for public engagement, such as in galleries, museums, and other public areas. These robots are able to imitate visitors' facial expressions and wink, grimace, and nod their heads. In general, Chinese businesses have achieved great strides in creating humanoid robots with a range of features. These devices are intended for application in a multitude of industries, including intelligent manufacturing and entertainment. Some developers are even proposing very unusual uses for the machines they created. According to data issued early in December 2023 by the International Federation of Robotics, China has surpassed the U.S. for the first time in history in terms of automation and robotic technologies. China is making great progress towards its goal of becoming the robotics industry leader, and it appears that this goal is being fulfilled. However, the United States still has a potential to overtake China in this competition, possibly not in terms of the quantity, but rather the quality of the robots being made. U.S. businesses like Figure and Tesla are concentrating on developing very advanced humanoid robots. Optimus, a humanoid robot that Tesla is currently building, is intended to carry out a variety of jobs, including helping around the house and working on assembly lines. Recently, Figure unveiled the Figure 02, carrying on their audacious endeavor to build adaptable humanoid robots. American engineers have an advantage over Chinese businesses that focus on mass production because they are particularly focused on the independence and adaptability of their innovations. Even while China now leads the world in the quantity of robots produced, the United States may be able to gain the upper hand in this race by concentrating on quality and innovation. All that's left to do is watch Chinese engineers work towards their goals and bide our time until Chinese robots take over the globe. And there you have it. The reasons why China is creating hundreds of humanoid robots every month. As the world's tech powerhouse, China's commitment to AI and robotics is reshaping industries and preparing for a future where robots play a key role in our daily lives. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on the latest innovations shaping our world. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.